going everyone, my name is AJ and today I'm going to answer a health question. I really appreciate all of the questions and articles you've sent my way to review. I just find it amusing that they all seem to hover around the same theme. But in any case, this article published in 2015 talks about a study done in Alberta, Canada which equates the benefits of drinking a glass of red wine to that of an hour spent at the gym. And this probably caused great rejoicing from bachelor and bachelorette watchers everywhere. But can something as simple as drinking a glass of red wine be just as effective as spending an hour in the gym? In this video, I'm going to answer this question based on what science has shown. If you are interested to see where I'm pulling my information from, feel free to check out the description below. And without further delay, let's get started. This article talks about a specific biochemical compound called resveratrol. Resveratrol is most commonly found in the skin of red grapes, so you could probably find it in your favorite bottle of red wine as well. The article then goes on to talk about the health benefits of resveratrol based on information gathered from this study. This information is then enhanced in the title of the article, A glass of red wine is the equivalent to an hour at the gym, says new study. As anticipated, I couldn't help but feel a little skeptical of the article's claim. So let's take a closer look. After reviewing the scientific paper that this particular article spoke about, it turns out they failed to mention a few things. This particular study and the vast majority of research on resveratrol to this point has been conducted in rats. Last time I checked, rats are quite different from us. Well, most of us. According to the lead author of the study, in order to get the same health benefit from resveratrol as the rats did in this study, you would have to consume anywhere from 100 to 1,000 bottles of wine in just one day. That's quite a bit more than just one glass. But wait! There's more! This particular study didn't even use red wine on their rats. Instead, the study added resveratrol as a supplement to the rats' standard chow diets. And to top it all off, the article left out the fact that the researchers were actually using resveratrol as a supplement to exercise. Meaning that instead of having one group of rats that exercised and another group of rats that didn't exercise, and was just supplemented with resveratrol, both groups exercised, except one group was given the supplement and the other was not. So to sum it all up, it's important to put these statements, especially ones you read on the internet, into proper context. So back to the original question. Is a glass of red wine equivalent to an hour at the gym? Based on what we know from a scientific perspective and what was presented in the article, I for one am not convinced. But maybe I'm a little biased towards exercise. And for all I know I might have missed something. So what do you guys think? If you guys find another interesting article that you would like me to review, feel free to leave it in the comments below or share it on Facebook or Twitter. And hey, who knows, maybe I'll feature it in one of my later videos. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and share it with your friends. And if you'd like to see me keep making content, feel free to subscribe and hit the big red button right below me. I release new videos every week. In any case, thank you all so much for watching and stay strong.